So I'm going to talk a little bit of the mobility protocols that we have with the Phoenix uh, edition of our ACDC unique waveform that is very similar to a, a Theristim unit. Um, when we, if you know anything about eccentric contractions, okay, if you see the ARX in the background right here, uh, the ARX, if you know anything about strength training, you know about eccentric training, you know about the ARX. So you know we talk, we know what we're talking about when we're talking about eccentric training. I'm not going to talk a lot about eccentric training right now. I'm just going to show you how we could use eccentric training to increase flexibility. Okay, so I'm going to do my basically my toe touch here. So I'm going to stand. I'm going to go down, touch. I can almost get to my my toes. Okay. Now we know one of the best ways to increase flexibility is with eccentric strength training or eccentric. Um, stretching, right? So a good way to do eccentric stretching or strength training to increase mobility in the hamstring would be what? Pushing down really hard with my hamstring as I'm lengthening it, right? So eccentric training, I'm contracting my muscles while the muscle is lengthening, okay? That's great, but that gets really hard to do on yourself, or ideally I would need to be laying maybe on my back, have a couple guys probably pushing against me while I'm contracting my hamstring and then they're stretching me, right? Makes it even harder if we're talking about something like a quadricep because quadricep could be completely overpower someone. So yeah, I could have some people holding my, 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 my leg, I'm trying to contract, but what they're actually doing is, well this muscle's contracting, they're stretching me, right? And that's eccentric contraction, the muscle's contracting while it's lengthening. We know there's huge strength training benefits to eccentric training like the ARX, but you, we also know it has huge mobility work, okay? So, we found a way, or you probably might have seen this before, the way to do mobility work that you could do by yourself, taking advantage of the eccentric training. And what we use for that is we use our Globus, our Globus unit. Uh, it's actually the Phoenix edition of the Globus unit. The regular Globus unit does not have the ACDC current in it, okay? So if you go on search the internet for a, um, a Phoenix, I mean sorry, the Globus, you won't see the Phoenix within your typical Globus, Globus unit. We had an engineer put this, uh, the ACDC unique waveform uh, that is very similar to like an ARP wave into this. So like I said, you won't see the, the Phoenix in there, you need to get the Phoenix edition. So our program, what we're doing is we go to our Phoenix edition, start that, and I'm starting the contraction. One thing I actually love about this Phoenix is the mobility. This is just a hiking little pouch that I had in my car at the time we have it, but it works awesome because um, this thing's so mobile. Okay, so now what I'm doing, see, I can just put it in there and I, I can move around, I can do whatever I want, this is awesome. So what am I doing, okay? I am contracting, I have this hooked up to my calf and my hamstrings, okay? They're causing my hamstrings to contract, and my calves can contract. Okay, turn it up a little bit. Okay. That's wrong. Okay, so basically what, what, what's happening here is we have our muscles contracting, right? So we're taking the, the, the mind or the body out of it, and we're stimulating the contraction of the hamstrings and quads, I'm sorry, the hamstrings and the gastrox to me. So now what I'm going to do, is I'm gonna, I flex my, my toes up a little bit, and now I'm going down. So what am I doing? My hamstrings and my calves, or gastrols, and so is, are under contraction, and I'm going through a movement that is causing them to lengthening. So basically what we're doing is we're doing eccentric training. Right now I don't have it so strong. I have it just strong enough where I'm getting a nice contraction, and I'm going down further and further. And you can see I'm down to the floor, you know, already just in those couple reps. Let me just turn this down. So we turn that down. Remember, I was just almost to my toes, I believe. And now down to the hands, okay? Um, so we basically do the same thing with any body part that we want to increase mobility with. Okay, so this is a very quick way, and the mobility of this thing is just awesome, right? So I just did some mobility work. I caused the hamstrings to contract. I caused the gastrics and the soles to contract. Then what did I do? The muscles are contracting. 
I take them through an eccentric range of motion. The muscle stim is not causing the eccentric contraction. The muscle stimulation phoenix is causing the contraction. Then I'm taking it through an eccentric range of motion, which is me lengthening it, you know, down. And we could do the same thing with any other body part. We could put the stimulation on the quads and the glutes. Then we could do deep squats. Same thing. What's happening? Muscles are contracting. Muscles are contracting. Now we're lengthening the quads by going through a squat. Um, if you did nothing else, as far as the mobility protocols with the Phoenix, um, that alone is just unbelievable. You do that before your event, uh, before you train. Um, it's just, like I said, the only way you could do, maybe understand this, try it out, go to the website. We do offer a rental program, program on this, so you can try it out for a month. And during that time, we work with you. Okay, we want you to get most out of this unit. Um, we've seen the benefits of the, the Therastim and that unique ACDC wave we've been using in our office for probably around 15 years. Um, the, we just do the mobility on people like this and they're just blown away. We get them to touch their toes when they never touch their toes. So, and you know, that goes along to as far as like, you know, sports performance, okay? If you're familiar with the functional movement stream, right? It's just a toe test, it's a lunge, it's a basic movement. We're trying to sit there and understand, get you to do a basic movement. Because if, if you can't touch your toes, if you can't do a lunge properly, if you can't do a squat properly, well, the, like I said, in functional movement, the functional movement screen, they have linked that to a higher incident of non-contact injuries, okay? So, you start with the basics, right? You start with mobility, get yourself moving so you can perform those movements. In our opinion, the, the, the eccentric movements or mobility exercises where you cause the muscles to contract and then you take your body through an eccentric range of motion produces the fastest um, results of mobility yet. So go to the website if you want some more information. Like I said, we're here to help you. Uh, if you're interested in renting a unit, contact us. Then we'll work with you and find out how to get the most out of uh, the, the Phoenix Wave or the Phoenix Edition.